hello everyone thank you for tuning in today's recipe i'll be showing you how to make delicious nigerian party fish i am rosie and you are welcome to my kitchen i will be using this fish and that is the name right there you can use any fish of your choice I have the fish nicely cut and skilled already and to clean the fish I'm using vinegar this will cut down the smell of fish you can use lemon you can use lime and you can also use salt to clean fish as well I will clean the fish one after the other until I am done I will transfer it back and rinse the fish. And leave it in a strainer to drain out before using it. Here I have some bell peppers, habanero peppers, tomatoes, onions, and for seasoning, I'll be using this season here. For fish, you don't need a lot and you can use any season of your choice. I will season with ginger powder, onion powder, garlic powder, salt, obe season. Obe season is great season for seafood. And I'll use my hand to rub it so all the season can penetrate inside the fish. And I will cover with a clean film. You can cover with anything of your choice. And I'm going to be leaving this fish to marinate in the refrigerator. And you can go ahead to start frying right away. I will leave it to marinate before using it. Here I have the peppers, onions, and tomatoes cleaned, ready for blending. And I'll be roughly blending them. And that is done. I will transfer the blended pepper inside the pots. And I'm going to be boiling the pepper down before using it. However, you can also use the pepper without boiling it. I will cover. So here I have the pepper. The pepper has boiled down a bit and that is ready. In an empty pot, I will add in some avocado oil. And once the oil is hot, I will add some diced onions. And I will fry the onions for about a minute or two. Next, I will add the cooked pepper mix. And stir. I will season with thyme, curry powder, seasoned powder, salt, stir and I will allow this to fry a bit. So here is the fish, the fish is out of the refrigerator. I will leave it out and it's time to start frying the fish next I'll add some oil in the pan and allow the oil to heat up while the oil is heating up I will set where to place the fish once the fish is out of the hot oil and once the oil is hot I will add one onions and some garlic and this will infuse more flavor into the fish 
and I will add the fish and fry on a medium to high heat. Allow the fish to fry on one side before flipping it to the other side. And this fish I'm using is very nice. It doesn't contain so much bones. And once the fish are nicely fried, I'll take them out of the oil. And I'll repeat the process with the rest of the fish. Here I have all the fish nicely fried and they look absolutely delicious. So here the sauce is be fried now for a while and this sauce is ready. At this point you can taste and adjust for seasoning if needed and transfer the fried fish in there and I'm going to be doing it in badges. And stir the fish, gently stir the fish to coat it with the pepper sauce. Once that is done, I will garnish it with some green bell peppers and onions, which are nicely diced, and then stir. And I will leave it in the sauce for about a minute or two. And then take out the fish one after the other. And I will repeat the process with the rest of the fried fish. And once that is done, I will take them out of the sauce as well. And the fish is ready. And this fish was very moist and super delicious. Thank you all so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe if you're not already. Remain blessed. I will see you in my next video. Bye.